Hi and welcome to another Instrument Choice support video. In this video we'll demonstrate how to calibrate and take a BRICS measurement on the BRM100 BRICS refractometer. To perform calibration and measurements you will need the refractometer, the included cotton cloth, disposable lint free tissues is optional, the calibration tool, plastic pipette, distilled water and the liquid sample that you wish to measure. For accurate results both the calibration and sample to be measured should be the same temperature. With no measurement solution on the prism, the scale will be completely blue. To calibrate, wipe down the prism using the cloth to remove any dust. Use the pipette to apply two to three drops of distilled water to the prism. Close the cover plate. The distilled water should spread across the entire surface of the prism without any air bubbles or dry spots. Hold the prism in the direction of a light source and look through the eyepiece. The scale will now have a lower white portion. The white and blue portion should meet exactly at the zero marking of the scale. If the boundary between the blue and white is anywhere else, use the calibration tool to turn the calibration screw until the boundary meets at zero. Calibration is complete. Remove the distilled water from the prism and dry. Now it's time to take a measurement. To measure a liquid sample, place two to three drops onto the prism. Close the cover plate. And again, ensure that no air or dry gaps appear. Hold the prism in the direction of a light source, then look through the eyepiece. This time the boundary between the white and blue is a bricks measurement of your sample. In this case, it's around 7%. After use, always clean the prism well and ensure it is completely dry before storage. And that's how to calibrate and take an accurate bricks measurement on the BRM100 bricks refractometer. For more information on this or other BRICS refractometers, speak with an Instrument Choice Scientist. Call 1300 737 871 or email customer-service at instrumentchoice.com.au. We hope that you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching.